Hello, it's Marshall Adler. I'm the founder of iRank Fast. Thank you so much for watching this B2B advanced Q&A video that we'd like to send out to people who are on the fence about the B2B service that we offer or are considering it and just have additional questions or might want to know additional data before jumping on board with the rest of the people who are dominating and generating leads in their niche every week with our help. So in this video, we're going to talk about uh, what are our, our what are all the fees and who is responsible for what? Will I be seen as a spammer by others? Will I receive any backlash or complaints as a result of the service? And what do I do if someone writes me a mean note or if LinkedIn suspends my account, which could happen? Uh, rarely it does, but on occasion it can. Um, and am I allowed to go in and make posts and engage others if we're working together? And how often do I communicate or update you on leads and calendared calls? So let's jump into it. Okay. So the very first question, what are all the fees and who is responsible for what? So the answer is it's $79.99 a month for LinkedIn premium and $80 a month for Ulink, which is kind of like an external LinkedIn software. It kind of looks like a LinkedIn overlay, but it connects to your um, LinkedIn account and allows me to go in and act as you and many other people on their accounts. Um, and as long as you're paying for LinkedIn premium, we will actively pay for Ulink, which is the only LinkedIn approved third party software allowed to connect your LinkedIn account and send out messages as you to your audience and the people that we connect with. Now you are responsible for LinkedIn. We are responsible for Ulink and we'll maintain that account for as long as you have an active LinkedIn premium account. Now, will you be seen as a spammer by others? Answer, every so often someone might make a nasty remark or comment on your message to them negatively and they might claim you're a spammer or to tell, they might tell you to stop spamming them, etc. All you have to do is nothing. Let iRank Fast handle it. We will apologize on your behalf for any inconvenience and we will just carry on with life. Those people are few and far between, but occasionally you do find the person who's calling you a spammer and all, all we do is apologize for any inconvenience and move on with our life. People who view you as such are rare when you're a social influencer with your own audience built on trust. Occasionally when you do mass targeting or mass marketing, you are going to get the person who calls you a spammer, but they're not going to do anything really about it um, which kind of segues into the next question will I receive any backlash or complaints as a result of this service yes it's no secret that mass marketing has good and bad outcomes if you do it right like we do at I ring fast you will get one person out of every thousand who is having a bad day whose spouse yelled at them that day and they decide to take out their problems on you by calling you and making business legal threats or they send you message after message over LinkedIn with antagonizing remarks um, after you sent them an initial message or offer after connecting with them um, or worse, they tell LinkedIn on you. Again, we you do nothing. We just apologize for you for you on your behalf and we carry on with our life. Those people, again, are few and far between, but you are going to experience once in a while the occasional you know psychopath who has decided that you're the reason for all their problems in life okay so next we're going to go on to what do i do if someone writes me a mean note or if linkedin suspends my account answer if someone writes you a mean note or comment you do nothing you let i rank fast handle it we will address any upsets on your behalf and handle it accordingly usually with blocking the person, removing their connection, stopping following them, etc., and writing them a note back if we need to or or sending their taking screenshots and sending all that to the LinkedIn managers that we know who monitor, you know, bad connections. Now, if LinkedIn happens to suspend your account, which can happen when you're doing mass marketing over LinkedIn as a social influencer because every so often people click that you know I don't know this person and if you get too many of those in the course of a, of a certain time period your account can get suspended that is not something you should ever really truly worry about as knock on wood it's only happened to me twice over the course of five years so um, I'm hoping to continue you know my success 
and with a reward of not having any more you know issues like that but in the event that they do suspend your account all you have to do is i'll send you a link to where you could go and appeal um with your name and information and just say you're sorry and you didn't mean to do anything wrong and that you won't do it again and after a week they will reactivate your account and give you an, a warning not to violate the terms and conditions again and that is it and after that you they usually allow you to continue doing what you were doing and they don't suspend you again even if people click i don't know you because they know that you know you're not trying to do anything to cause it it just ha so happens to happen like that because when you send out 2000 messages in a month you're just going to have a per the math just always wins you're going to have a percentage of people saying yes a large percentage saying no and the occasional weirdos who you know just can't you know get over the fact that you're succeeding in life and that is really what it comes down to all right next am i allowed to go in and make posts and engage others if you're working with me the answer is no. Once we become your LinkedIn managers who act as you on your account through Ulink, it is our job to engage with anyone who engages with you. Going in and engaging people in your inbox, especially on like the weekend when we don't uh, generally work and provide leads for, to our clients, that takes away from the leads that I report on daily, Monday through Friday, and that diminishes the value of the service. Also, we make posts three times a week already, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, to to be compliant as social influencers on LinkedIn. Any more than that would be overkill and would violate the terms and conditions in working with us and in working with on LinkedIn and being a social influencer. If they see too much content, you actually can get flagged for that. So there's a certain amount of content you're supposed to do, and we do it three times a week, which is pretty much the max you're supposed to do to build up social influence, okay? Next, how often do you communicate or update me on leads and calendar calls? The answer is daily at random times. Before 5 p.m., you will always have an email from me at some point about your leads for that day. It'll say, it'll come across in an email from me to you and in the subject line, it'll say B2B update and today's date. And that's the, the email you wanna look forward to every day because that will show you who said yes to your offers. Okay, and you'll have all those leads given to you, name, phone, email, contact, you know, what we did on your behalf, etc. So you get all prepped and ready for the for the week ahead. Now, um, we post Monday, Wednesday and Friday at random times before 5 p.m. as well on your behalf. There's no set times of when we make the post, but we do them Monday, Wednesday and Friday at random times before 5 p.m. Uh, Mountain Standard Time. Again, that we do all of that just to stay compliant so that we can send out these mass target, you know, mass messages and offers to C-level decision makers all over the country. Again, if you want to see how we get three to five B2B decision makers weekly to say yes to amazing offers, go to irankfast.com, fill out the form on the front page above the fold, or shoot me back an email and I'll shoot you back a demo of how it all works. Thanks so much for watching. Cheers.